Okay, uh, good evening everyone. We'll call to order the um, bi-monthly meeting of the City of Douglas Mayor Commission for the evening of October 13, 2014. Uh, welcome everybody to tonight uh, and happy Columbus Day to everybody. A uh, holiday for some folks in our community, but uh, we will proceed on with our meeting and uh, thank you all for being here. I appreciate uh, everybody's input. This time I will call on uh, Commissioner Pearson for our invocation, please. Thank you, Mayor. At this time, we're going to ask Mr. Tommy Hale, one of our department managers, to give us a prayer, please. Okay, let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we just thank you for another opportunity to come together to do things that we need to be doing for this community, Lord. Help us to be united in service and in love for the people of this community and do those things that will bring honor and glory to your holy name. We just ask all this most heavenly and precious name of your Son and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you, Tom. Thank you. Thank you, thank you Commissioner Pearson. Uh, this time, if you please stand with me, we'll have our Pledge of Allegiance led by Lieutenant Junior Grade Dilly Agris and Lieutenant Shepard from the ROTC program. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, Thank you very much, cadets. I uh, appreciate you being here tonight. Okay, we uh, we okay, Mr. Johnny? We we good to go. Get some feedback, a little bit. Okay. Okay, maybe we've got our technical issues <laughs> fixed, and so we'll proceed on. Uh, first order of business is to approve the minutes of the work session and regular meeting for September 22nd. Uh, as corrected in the work session, need a motion to approve the minutes, please. So make a motion we accept the minutes. Mayor, motion, Mayor Pro Tem has made a motion. Second. Commissioner Swain second. All in favor say aye. 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 All opposed? Motion carried. Minutes are approved. Next order of business is to approve the order of agenda as established uh, in the work session. Need a motion to approve the agenda. So moved. Motion by Commissioner Moore. Second. Second by Commissioner Hutchinson. All in favor say aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carries. Agenda is approved. First order of business uh, in the agenda uh, from the work session is to discuss the approval of land water conservation fund grant. Uh, Ms. Dale Batten will bring that forward. We recommend that the commission approve a resolution authorizing Mayor James H. Dennis to execute the grant agreement and any subsequent amendments between the City of Douglas and the Georgia Department of Natural Resources for land and water conservation funds for grant number 13-00946 in the amount of $100,000 to fund tennis court renovations at Davis Wade in Wheeler Parks and authorize required matching in the amount of $100,000 to come from Splash Five funds allocated for recreation activities. We haven't heard the recommendations. Is there a motion? No. Motion by Commissioner Swain. Is there a second? Okay. Second by Commissioner Moore. Is there a discussion? Is there a discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. 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 All opposed? Motion carried. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Tim. Our next item of business is to discuss the GBI Southeastern Regional Drug Enforcement uh, Task Force. Uh, Chief Castellos will bring that forward. Mayor, Commission, here tonight to uh, ask you to consider and approve the assignment of one of the current city assigned narcotics investigators that are with the uh, Joint City County Drug Task Force uh, to the GBI Southeastern Regional Drug Enforcement Team and uh, approve the Memorandum of Intergovernment and Interagency Agreement and allow Mayor James Dennis uh, to execute the same. Yeah, heard the recommendations or motion? So move. Motion by Commissioner Hudson, second by Commissioner Moore. Is there a discussion? Is there any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. 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 All opposed? Motion carried. Thank you. Thank you, Chief. Next item business is to discuss the waiver for Martin Theater for the Coffee Alliance of the Arts. Mr. Johnson will bring that forward. The Mayor and the Commission tonight would like to, to uh, 
come before you to waive the rental fee for the Martin Theater, for the Coffee Alliance, for the Arts. The rental fee would be four hundred dollars. So you wait. You want to request to waive that fee? Hopefully. Yes, sir. Okay. That's what I'd like to request. Okay. Are the recommendations or a motion? Second motion. Mayor Pro Tem has made a motion. Is there a second? Second. Second by Commissioner Swain. Is there a discussion? I have a question. Question. Uh, question. Question. Prior to, uh, I know the last two meetings that I missed, uh, City Manager Jacobs mentioned to me that I think it was going to be coming on the agenda about uh, facilities uh, using the, the uh, our centers, uh, agencies using our centers. And I'm sorry, but I haven't been updated. Has the mayor and commission voted to, to make a decision yeah. as to how they're going to handle that? At, at, at current, in relationship to the last decision, which was at the last meeting, if I recall, it, it is to continue uh, allowing staff to bring requests of individuals of potentially nonprofits to come forth to request a waiver of the rental fees. But now, uh, along with that, if they are granted, we would charge an administrative fee of $100 in regards to that, in regards to that. And they would still have to go through the process of the deposit, which they will get refunded back. Okay, so the administrative fee and deposit? So right. that's going to apply with everyone that we approve? Right. That, right? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. That's correct. All right. Thank you. Yes, ma'am. Any other questions or comments? Okay. All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. All opposed? The motion carried. Thank you. Thank you, Roger. Uh, next item business is to discuss the compost site splash improvement project. Uh, Mr. Mike Hudson will bring that forward. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, it's a recommendation that the Mayor and Commission approve a contract with Douglas Electric and Plumbing in the amount of $330,467.14 for the compost site improvement splash project. Okay. Any recommendations or a motion? No. Motion by Commissioner Anderson. Second by Commissioner Moore. Any discussion? Any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. All opposed? Aye. You get that one up? Yes, okay. Sir. Motion carried. Okay, next item business is to discuss the compost site leaf and limb uh, drop off of moratorium. Uh, Mr. Mike Hudson will begin to bring that for you. It is a recommend recommendation that the Mayor and Commission approve the fee schedule for receiving leaf and limb at the compost site and lift the moratorium on leaf and limb drop offs as discussed in the work session. Okay. Heard the recommendations. There a motion? So moved. Second. Mr. Mike and Mr. Anderson. Second by Mayor Pro Tem Josie. Is there a discussion? Any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. 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 All opposed? Aye. Have one, one negative. Aye. Motion carried. Okay, next item of business is to discuss the water wastewater contract with ESG for operations and maintenance. Mr. Mike Hudson will bring that forward. It is a recommendation that the Mayor and Commission approve the contract with the ESG as discussed in the work session. Are the recommendations there a motion? No motion by Commissioner Anderson. Second by Commissioner Hutchinson. Is there a discussion? Is there any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carried. Abstain, I abstain. As I stated in the work session, I haven't had a chance to review the contract, but I would like to state that based on everything that I have heard, I do believe that this is a positive move, but I just have not reviewed the contract. Okay. So we had one abstain. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Next item, Biz. Thank you, Mike. Uh, next item is to discuss the conversion of five Dodge Chargers and one Freightliner vehicle to compressed natural gas. Uh, Mr. Terry Festerman was standing in for Stanley Merritt. We'll bring that forward. Thank you, Mayor. It is the recommendation that the Mayor and Commission approve, as discussed in the night's work session, the purchase of the CNG conversion kits as well as approve the installation of these kits for five Dodge Chargers and one Freightliner vehicle, which will allow these vehicles to use compressed natural gas at a total cost of $57,350, going to Phoenix uh, Energy. Phoenix mm -hmm. Energy. Okay. Are the recommendations or a motion? So moved. Motion by Commissioner Hutchins. Is there a second? Second. Second by Commissioner Swain. Discussion? I got a question. Uh, you said five Dodges? Yes, sir. Five Dodges. Vehicles, not a Dodge. His is not being done. His is not in this bid. Yes, sir. His is being done under the DOE uh, contract. Yes, sir. Okay. 
Any other discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. 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 All opposed? Motion carried. Thank you. WDTV 13. Programming is sponsored by Storage Solutions, etc. Locally owned and operated and located at 1010 Bowens Mill Road, southeast in Douglas. Vickers Audio and Glass Tinning. Supporting our local programming on WDTV 13. Fletcher Oil Company, since 1966, has been supporting local activities and a proud sponsor of community programming on WDTV 13. Fletcher Oil Company is a member of the Women's Business Enterprise National Council. Roscoe Allen Jr. and Gubas Modular Buildings in Osceola, Georgia. We proudly support local programming on WDTV 13. Dewey Hayes Jr., attorney at law, selected to the top 100 trial lawyers in the state of Georgia. Harper and Company Builders, serving Douglas and Coffee County for 29 years. And a proud sponsor of community programming. 100 Men in Black and Roscoe Allen Company. 100 Men in Black working to bring unity to our community since 2002. If you want your pizza fixed just right, chances are you'll go to Danny's. If you're celebrating a birthday, Holtz is probably fixing the cake you'll put the candles on. And if your wedding ring needs an adjustment, you'll find yourself at Crawford Jewelers. But if it's you who needs fixing, it should definitely happen here. Coffee Regional Medical Center in Douglas, Georgia. We fix things better here. Next item is to discuss the flag storage uh, building for Lions Club. Uh, Mr. Tim White, our fire chief, will bring that forward. Uh, Mayor and Commission, it is our recommendation per the work session that the uh, city allows the Douglas Lions Club to relocate the location of the flag building from the water department to the fire department at Station 2 to make it more convenient to put out the flags on the holidays. Okay. Heard the recommendations. Our motion. Motion by Commissioner Swain, second by Commissioner Moore. Is there a discussion? <coughs> Is there a discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carry. Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, next item of business is to discuss change of uh, future meeting dates. Uh, Mr. Jacobs will bring that forward. Thank you, Mayor. As discussed in the work session in regards to the potential holiday dates of uh, potential uh, future meetings, uh, it is a recommendation to change the date from December the 22nd meeting to December the 18th meeting on that Thursday. Okay. Heard the recommendation. Is there a motion? Motion by Commissioner Swain. There a second? Second by Commissioner Moore. Is that correct? Any discussion? Any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. All opposed? The motion carried. Okay. Next item is to discuss the City of Douglas filming policies and procedures. Once again, Mr. Jacobs will bring that forward. Thank you, Mayor. As also discussed in the work session in regards to a proposed filming and policy and procedure, uh, we are recommending the approval of this policy and procedure for the City of Douglas going forth. Okay. okay. I had the recommendation for approving the policy and procedure for filming. Is there a motion? Like a motion. Mayor Pro Tem has made a motion. Commissioner Anderson has second the motion. Is there any discussion? Is there any discussion? All those in favor of the motion, please say aye. Aye. Uh, All opposed? Motion carried. Thank you. Okay. okay and that concludes all our work session items at this time. Uh, call on now staff for comments. Uh, Mr. Jacobs, you're going to stand in for Georgia. We're doing dual duty, I tell you. Uh, I'll be very brief because uh, staff has got a lot of announcements, and I will. Uh, definitely advise that um, the citizens who are watching this to go to our website www.cityofdouglas.com or get uh, they can also tell uh, go to our television station channel 13 to all, the list of all the events that we have in regards to that but just for the months of October and through hopefully the first of the year some city events that we like to be aware of October the 18th community junk collection day that's 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. have a rep